We agreed to intensify dialogue in coming weeks, and we expect the progress in the following areas. First, there will be a second meeting before the end of October. An agenda for that meeting will be worked out through diplomatic channels, and it will focus on nuclear issues, including proposals favorably put forward by both sides, and it will also deal with uh, some global issues that any of the parties wish to address. Second, Iran has told us that it plans to cooperate fully and immediately with the International Atomic Energy Agency on the new enrichment facility near Com or near Cum, and will invite the agency, the expert from the agency, to visit the facility soon. We expect within the next couple of weeks. On that issue, on that issue I also talked on the phone with the director of the agency, Mohammed El Baradei. Third, in consultation with the agency and on the margins of today's meeting, it was agreed in principle that the low and rich uranium produced in Iran would be transported to a third country for further enrichment and fabrication into full assembly for the Tehran Research Reactor, which, as you know, produce isotopes for medical application. Details on this point, which is a technical one, will be worked out in a meeting of experts from the agency and countries interested, in particular the United States, the Russian Federation and France, in Vienna on the 18th of October, so that implementation can begin as soon as possible. In conclusion, I should say that this uh, is only a start, and we shall need to see uh, progress uh, some of the practical steps we have discussed today.